laying here on the earth on my back watching the clouds go by. The sky's so bright, I can't even look at it with my eyes. Pretty cool. How long's it been since you laid on your back out in the woods? Well, that's too long. Son of a gun. Dan, I'm going to go around the corner. William went up yonder way. He's gone. He's probably way up there by now. We came to look at this riprap that we already walked past. I spotted it. It's back that way about three, four hundred yards. And he was disappointed. I said, we're already a mile from camp. Now he done gone around the corner. He's allowed to be over that ridge by now. But, uh, It's plum gorgeous out here. Cool, breezy. Life is good. I'm sitting there watching this big opening by the creek. Cannot find the gopher. Have not fired my gopher gun yet. Talk to you later. Adios. Nice mule deer doe right up there. Big old mule deer doe. She's up there, brown spot, probably can't see her. Right here by the creek. We hiked way up that gated road yesterday. Now I'm standing here at the big log jam. Big log jam right here on the river. We got bluebirds. Western Montana bluebirds circling. Chimney swifts circling. Blocking the creek from way up on that. First, he hiked right past way up yonder somewhere with my binoculars scouting out new territory. Yonder. Way back down by camp. It's cloudy. So they're just not out. They like sunny, still day, so they can hear the hawk, see the hawk, or their predators. They like nice hawk jam. Nice country. Camp back down yonder about half a mile. Y'all have a good one. Adios. Probably have one of them Mountain House Kitty Meals. Mountain House Kitty Meals. They've made them smaller. Dan and I are in a thicket where the creek comes out. Here's where Fluffy been digging on the ground right here probably. Yeah. But we come down where this creek comes out and there's just, what, elderberry? Elderberry. Everywhere. Bushes. All kind of berry bushes. Perfect bear habitat. The road goes off yonder way back toward the back toward that way but it's just thick as a I don't know what in here yeah to continue but, on we'd need a lot more food and probably 10 years younger <laughs> yeah no I'll come up here again and, and walk that road you know what the hell I want to see it this I'm road right to, here yeah I'll walk down there sometimes and this is a nice thicket there's a patch of snow up there on the mountain still. Yesterday we were right there. Yesterday we were yeah. way up on that draw. Yeah. Way up on that hill on the side, yep. side, side hill. hill in it. Now we know. Which backing? That water comes out of there awful slow, so there's really no water down here. There's no water running through here right now, no. but you can tell it has in the oh, past. Yeah. Big old log jams up there.
cool. I'm gonna sign off and then take another shot further up. I say right here is where that creek comes down. Yeah. It comes out of that canyon up there where we were yesterday. Comes right down through here and into the used to be a road right here. But we don't understand why all these rocks are out in the road. There's a beaver chewed stick right there. These rocks look like they were dumped from a small trailer, you know. And they go up here. Look at those elderberry bushes all torn up. Oh yeah, they eat them. This is bear paradise right here. They eat them all. Everything eats it. Deer, bear, elk, you know. Moose. Everything eats elderberry. In here tearing it up. That's a big elderberry bush, isn't it? Did you call it a stalk? Yeah, the stalk. Yeah, yeah the stalk. Branches. Again, there's that draw where this creek comes down. Dan's walking out and all this lush, all kind of berries out here. So, if you're out here in the thick of this stuff, we highly recommend you carry a good hog leg, cousin. So, beautiful country. We're going to head back to camp. Pig out. You're in a nice thicket, ain't you, buddy? My speaker slamming shut every time I hear something. Yep. Bear thickets. There's camp way over yonder. I think we did. I think so. We're coming out of the bear thicket. Headed back to camp. Camp's right over yonder. Alaskan pop up camper. This all used to occupy this whole area. Not all of it, but it's fortunate to look. This whole area is what? It's thick. This is how this whole canyon used to look. All thick like this and yeah. plus big timber. Not all of it, but a good portion of it. It's nasty. It's spooky. Yeah, beautiful. There's our camp. That's the end of the road. Yep. The gate right past our camp, right, right at the creek. So we hiked across the gated bridge and been walking up and down. Danny William, he done hiked way up yonder, all back down. He just keeps going, man. He goes around the corner, says, I'm just going to go look around the corner for a minute. And he goes like another two or three miles. Uh, it's just amazing. Signing off.